This block over here is what we're harvesting today. It's actually called the New Field. Um, and we are picking Bonnier, official state grape of Virginia. And my grandfather actually brought it to the state. Rhone varieties do really well in the state of Virginia. Bonnier is originally from the Rhone Valley of France, which is almost the same parallel. We um, decide when to harvest, when um, we get a good brick count and a good pH count. Um, so we'll take one of the clusters and we'll put it through processing. These are secondary, so they actually won't be harvested because they're not ready. Um, if you can see like the little, shop, those are called shot berries. Um, this is not quite ready. Um, it'll probably be ready around ooh, December-ish. So we, um, we do everything by hand. Um, and then there's um, special shears. So you literally like grasp the, cl the, the cluster and then you'll take a shear right about there and then drop it into the lug. We'll have our crew come out, take the grapes and put them in the lugs and then they'll mark them with their little indicator. And then you put them underneath the vine so when the tractor comes through, it's easier for it so you don't have to worry about hitting any of the lugs. So you're gonna have some seeds in them and then some like, you know, oogie bits. And then your skins are gonna be a little thicker than what you can in the store. Um, and they're going to be tartar. I like to drink wine that I call Punk Rocky. Um, so it's a little unfinished, a little more like rough on your taste buds. She's tired of drinking red wine when it's 80 degrees out. So we came up with Pinotage Rosé, which is really, that was the star of the show. Rosé wine for a red wine drinker to be able to drink in the summer and not be as heavy. Tit for tat, which is 100% Tariga Nationale, a nice red table wine. This leaf is a Vonier leaf, and you can definitely tell by the darker color, shaped like that. Um, and then this is a Petite Mansain leaf, um, which is vastly different, um, not even in color, but also in texture. And this is a Petite Mansain cluster. Um, which came off like, right over there. Um, and this is a Vonier cluster. Um, so they're both the same kind of color because they're a white wine and therefore white grapes. Um, but there are some major differences. A, first right off the bat you can kind of see, size difference. Um, the Vonier is typically known to have these broad shoulders um, and elongated cluster with a fat. Petite Mansain's a little more um, smaller. So the Vonier, which is this one, um, it's going to have more of a honeysuckle flavor when it's fermented down um, and made into wine versus a Petite Mansain is going to have more of a pineapple, um, pina colada feel to it. Um, they're both dry. We make them both into a dry wine. You can make them into a sweeter version. Um, we do have a sweet version of Petite Mansain called Late Harvest Petite Mansain. It's a little different process than what we have here. Dowager is a Victorian term that means the woman in charge. White wine people typically may say is a woman's wine, but so this white wine is in charge. So we've done those three and we have two more in the works. 